A friend asked me if I had ever done a book about my hearing. I'm, I'm deaf, so so I answered yes, I had, and I had done a book called The Book of Days and Ears, and it the covers are made out of leather, and I hand sewed the binding with a Coptic stitch, and the the back is is plain leather, and I used a diary style uh, format. And so here we have the, the book title, which I began in 2003. So this is some years back. And I began with the inciting event, which was my, my hearing aid that I had then going kaput. And that began in July. And I dealt with that all the way through to October. No, and so I I had to fuss back and forth with the hearing aid company in Oklahoma that I uh, had had dealt with there, and it was a long drawn out. It was it was difficult, and uh, I'm I'm very deaf, and so I'm I'm really hard to fit, and so there's that, and then there was as I wrote back here there's there was the dragon lady, which uh, she was. You know, passive-aggressive, micro-aggressive stuff. Anyway, so through all of that, dealing with that, I did artwork, and I just kind of kept, you know, a running diary of friends coming to visit and, you know, meals that we had. Um, I, I did some, some paper marbling. And since I hand sewed the book, I could sew those in into the, the little samples into the book. And I, I, with another friend, I did some letter press and block printing, and so I glued that into my book. And I, I just kept a diary through the months. So here we are through August, through various things we did, and finally the hearing aids came in in August. So that's about a month later after I originally uh, bought them and anyway we had ice cream and you know just stuff going on we had some wine and I collected some stamps and uh, and then you know I was still having trouble with the hearing aids in September it was pretty pretty nasty anyway um, I just kept it, Interacting with my friends and doing art projects with my friends really helped me deal with that time. And then I finally got to see somebody in October. See, it just took a long time. But anyway, so yeah, I've done a book about my hearing aid, hearing experiences. But the best thing was recording about friends' visits and art projects and backgammon games. So it, it was a fun fun project, and it helped keep me sane during that time. I hope you've enjoyed seeing it.